Okay, so welcome back. We're back at Zoo's Hope. We've got a pocket full of side quest items. Commander, and, what can I do uh, for you? Gonna talk to some guys. Some of the colonists are acting strange. We're a close-knit group, Commander. Most of us have lost loved ones, friends. Hmm. These aren't trained soldiers. Nobody taught us how to deal with the horrors of war. This is our home. We've watched the Geth slowly destroy everything that is important to us. Don't judge us too harshly. Hmm, okay, I guess. I destroyed a Geth transmitter in the tunnels. They won't be a problem any longer. Thank you, Commander. We're in your debt. You've taken a great weight off my shoulders. I just wish I had such good news for every problem. Okay. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Got some, uh, tasty Paragon points for that. Always welcome. And, uh, let's see. Who did we need to talk to? Okay. We've got this, uh, water lady. No. The water started running not long ago. Thanks to you, I assume. Now we just need to deal with the Geth and we can get back to growing this colony. Here, you for your trouble. Look at all Thank that you again, money Commander. and Paragon points and experience. It's like Christmas. Okay, singularity. Yes, and uh, yeah, let's get a couple of points in singularity. Let's uh, maybe. Yeah. Oh, but advanced. Yeah, I can't really turn down the chance to have advanced singularity for Liara. Um, and, uh. Hmm. Uh, let's put some into decryption for Garrus, because uh, we will probably be coming against some locks and things. We need to be the master of unlocking. Nice work with those Geth. Glad you showed up. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. Are you also Jennifer Hale? How many people in this bloody game does Jennifer Hale voice? I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? I knew they'd turn up eventually. Here, Fidan gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. Now if I can kick these power cells into place, I'll have this colony up and running in no time. Cha-ching! Oh, yes. We are raking in the boon dollars. Hello again, Commander. I killed the big Baron. The rest are yours. Excellent. I'll organize a hunt when the immediate threat of the Geth is gone. Uh... Okay. Uh... I have to go. Here. For your trouble. It's not much I know, but it's all we can spare. Okay, well that's not bad at all. Got another exclamation mark. What's with the other exclamation mark? Commander, is there something I can help you with? I have to go. I guess... Please do what you can to stop the attacks. Oh, what's that? Okay. Um... That guy sounds like the same voice actor as Udina. I guess they didn't have as many VAs on this game. Hello? Commander? What can I do for you? There's a guy living down in the tunnels. Is he one of yours? That would be Ian. He's very sick. Okay. <laughs> no kidding. Uh... What do you need done to get this place back on its feet? Getting rid of the Geth in the tunnels helped us immensely, Commander. But there are still some other mundane necessities, like food, We've water, and power it. to think of. I'm not sure where we stand on those matters. You should talk to the people overseeing them. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Are you gonna be less of a bitch to me now that I've sorted... I'm grateful for what you've done, but your heroics don't impress me, Commander. That don't impress me much. Um... Fine. Goodbye. Bye. Commander. Seriously, what are you gonna do to get a break in this colony? Oh, hi, I just killed a monster to feed your colony, turned on all of your water 
things, even though they were swarmed with geth, took care of the geth who were swarming all around in the tunnels, and... <laughs> you cannot please these people! Who's in, t in uh, the mood for some elevators? They tried to build a life here, but now all they have are ruins. Yeah, that's very true, Liara. Oh! Oh, this time we skip the elevator. Watch out! What? Scouts! Oh, uh, they'll be here any minute now. I don't know how much more I can take. How's it going, guys? That's the last of them. Okay. Oh, joy. How did the Mako even get here? It can teleport places just to antagonize me. <sighs> alack and alas, let us uh, set off. Ugh. No one to drive the Mako. It smells. What? Was something talking there? Oh god, no. You are freaking kidding me. Just. No. Where are they? Oh. The last batch went south. What are they looking for? We are receiving a weak comm signal. I cannot pinpoint its location through the gap interference. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, and just for extra fun in this bit, if you go over the edge, more on the comm, die. Commander. But I still can't get a fix. Uh, Any sign of movement? Elizabeth could still be in there. It's only been a few days. Uh, come on, no, no. That was really close. I'm sure this is exactly what, what you think of when you think of an RPG slash cover based shooter. Jeez. Driving around frantically in a tank, trying to avoid getting shot to pieces. Is that. What's, oh, that's right. Yeah, there's a tunnel here we can go down into. Right, everybody out of the scuttle boat. Buggy, scuttle wagon, yeah, scuttle wagon. Let's call it that. Hello, is there anybody home? I'm just here with my two alien buddies. Woohoo! Hello. Um, can we come in? Clear. Yeah, I can tell it's clear, Garrus. Thank you. Okay. Oh. Well, I'll take them since. Alright. I might as well take this stuff. Um. Assassin. Is the assassin any good? Whoa! Look at all that crap. Might as well take it. Okay. Assassin. 
No, it's rubbish. It's completely rubbish. Um, let's uh, cooldown reduction is kind of cool, but first aid interface is just so much more useful. Let's give you a better first aid interface. I was about to say, wow, that's got good stats, but it's she can't wear it. And also it's got no tech protection whatsoever. Okay, back in the van. Where did I leave? Where did I park? Okay. I guess that was just an area to get you used to the idea that, yeah, there are sometimes these places you can or have to get out of the buggy and they're not always very easy to spot. We've got movement. Some kind of vehicle. Not one of the Geth. They've got us on visual. We must be close. Forget them. We need to deal with the Geth. Hello, there's a little more. Oh, we can go down there. Oh, come on, Garrus. Don't you want to see what's down here? I know I do. Hello, people. The party wagon is here with the party supplies. That's close enough! Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Get back, Juliana. Who are you? What do you want? Commander Shepard, I'm here to remove your Geth problem. You see? You worry too much. And you trust too easily, Juliana. I'm just glad to see a friendly face. I thought we were the only humans left on this planet. Phi Dan and some of the members of Zeus Hope are still alive. I thought you said they were all dead. I said they were probably all dead. They're surviving. The Geth really hit them hard. We know what that's like. Those damn synthetics are relentless. I'll do whatever I can to keep them away from you. But I need some information. What kind of information? Ignore him. The Geth are up in the Exogeny headquarters, just a bit further along the Skyway. Those headquarters are private property, soldier. Remove the Geth and nothing else. I'm not interested in your company's secrets. Commander, before you go, my daughter, Lisbeth, she's missing. They shouldn't waste time poking around. We could do a proper accounting of our casualties after the Geth are gone. Wow. That's my daughter you're talking about. She's still alive. I know it. Where's your daughter, Juliana? She was working in the Exogeny building when the attacks came. Oh, yeah, there were several places she could hide. For a short time. Screw you. I'm if she's find in there, her. I'll get her out. Thank you, Commander. Thank you. Do you know what the Geth are after? I have no idea. We certainly haven't found anything of use. Something Exogeny is keen to remind us of. We need to recoup our expenses. It's nothing personal. Tell me about the colony. We established ourselves here four years ago. Growth was steady until the attacks. Hmm. Our biggest challenge has been the lack of resources. There's just so little here of value. Still, we were making a go of it. It was even starting to feel like home. What brought you here? I guess I thought this would be the start of a new life. I wanted to go where I could feel like I was making a difference. Instead, everything we built is destroyed. It's very hard not to lose hope. Hmm. Where's your daughter, Juliana? Oh. Somewhere at the Exogeny headquarters, I hope. How did you get split up from the Zoo's Hope colony? Most of us live closer to the Exogeny building. Zeus Hope was mostly used as a port. When the Geth hit, we scattered. Until you told us about the others, we assumed they were killed in the first wave. Hmm. If we had known they were still alive, we might have attempted to join them. They're fairly secure now. Maybe you should do that. No, 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 no. I don't think that's a good idea. We, we have no vehicles, and the Skyway offers little protection. Like the building we're in now? Listen, our best hope is to sit tight and wait for company reinforcements. Come eventually. Hmm. What was the building used for? Oh, yeah, we repurposed that structure to serve as headquarters for Exogeny. That's mostly offices with a number of uh, light-duty R&D labs. Exogeny is a master at repurposing anything and everything. The company has to make a profit somehow, Juliana. Ferros is a long way from self-sufficient. Stay bunkered down until I find out what the Geth are after. Okay. Of course. And please remember, if you see my daughter, 
can do. We ran when the attack hit. Okay. We've been trapped for days. I hope you can get us out of this mess. Uh. Hmm. They can survive. Yeah, they can find it. Ah, this guy looks different and has a name. I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. Okay. What do you need? I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. Hmm. Sounds easy enough. What's the catch? No catch, really. It's dangerous work, but not for someone like you. People are quick to assume we enjoy being in hazardous situations. <laughs> it's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. Okay. I'll look around if I get the chance. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Of course, this all depends on getting out of here alive. Okay. Tell me about the data I'm getting for you. Plans for a few prototype mods? I'm a freelancer. Some of my mods are highly sought after. Why work in the middle of nowhere if your skills are so useful? Maybe I've got a bit of the frontier spirit in me. That, and the alternative is a bit too secure for my liking. Hmm. Freelancers don't have to worry about security as much, so long as we keep a low profile. Yeah, being a freelancer is cool. Okay, so Do you I have any idea what the geth were looking for? Freelance draw cartoons, uh, but whatever. That's for smarter men than me to figure out. I have no idea what anyone would want with this ruin. Okay. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. Oh, is there nobody selling things? No? Okay, so I guess let's end the episode here, and next time we will continue on our journey and uh, get to the Exogeny headquarters and uh, see what the haps are in that place. So until then, I will see you next time.